Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to factory reset your Lenovo G50. And uh, this is running Windows 10. It should work for most computers running Windows 10. I'm going to show you both ways to do the factory reset on it. I'm going to show you how to reset it if you can get to this, to the desktop and to the settings. And I'm also going to show you how to reset it if you have a password on it and you can't get into it. Um, I'll show you how to do the hard reset so you can start using it again. Alright, so first off, I'm going to show you this method, which is if you can get into it. All you're going to have to do is, uh, you're going to go over here where it says search. Let me zoom in a little bit. Over here it says search, and you're going to type in here. You're going to type in reset. Okay, and then uh, this option is going to come up that says reset this PC. You're going to click on that. All right, and then you're going to be presented with these two options, reset this PC or advanced startup. So you're going to select get started on reset this PC. All right, and then you're going to get uh, some more options. Uh, it says uh, reset it and keep my files or remove everything. So what you want to do is, uh, if you can get to this part of the computer, uh, you may want to save some stuff you don't want deleted, like pictures and documents. Um, once you're ready, you're going to select this option that says remove everything, um, and your computer will be completely reset back to its factory condition. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to hard reset it. Factory reset it if you can't get into the computer. So we're going to, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go to restart. Alright, so let's wait for it to turn on and get to that password screen. Alright, so the computer booted up. Let's click here. Now it's going to ask us to log in and it asks for the password. Alright, so I'm just going to put in a password. You're going to see that it's wrong. Password is incorrect. Okay. All right. So from here, what you're going to do is you're going to click here. You're going to hold the shift key, which on my computer is over here. Shift key. I'm going to hold it down. And while I'm holding it down, I'm just going to select restart and continue to hold on the shift key. All right, once you see the this menu come up, you let go of the shift key. All right, and then here it's going to give you a couple different options. You're going to select the one that says troubleshoot. All right, here you're going to select reset this PC. And then here it's going to give you those options, uh, keep my files or remove everything. So what you want to do is select remove everything. And the reset process will begin. So now we're just going to have to wait uh, a couple minutes might take uh, a little longer if you have a lot of stuff on the computer. All right, so now uh, it's going to give us a couple of different options to choose from uh, about the drivers. 
Alright, so here we're going to select, it's asking what drivers do you want to remove. So here we're just going to select all drives. That way we make sure that it, and then it's going to give us two more options, so we're going to select fully clean the drive. And then it's going to ask us to confirm by hitting reset over here. Alright, so now it says uh, resetting this PC 1%. So now we got to wait till it gets to 100% and then uh, we'll see what the next screen takes us to. I'm going to pause the recording and I'll continue recording when it's closer to 100%. Alright, so now the PC is uh, resetting at 99%. Um, it, this is, it's taken a little bit long, so remember to uh, plug in your laptop to the electricity because this is a long process. Um, I'm just going to stop recording here because uh, it's taken long at 99%. Um, so I'll keep recording after it's completed this step. All right, so yeah, I left the computer uh, resetting uh, the whole night last night. It was taking very long, so uh, I kind of just left it alone doing its thing. Uh, connected to the power, obviously, so that the battery wouldn't die. Okay, so uh, now it is, uh, it's been a couple of hours. Um, let's check now and see uh, how the process has come along. It should definitely be done by now. All right, so yeah, it looks like uh, it completed and uh, got to 100%. Um, as you can see, it's back at the uh, setup where you where we have to now uh, input in all the uh, different settings that we want, languages. Um, so there you go. The computer's been completely reset back to its factory condition. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this one. Thanks. Bye-bye.